I feel, I feel, I feel, yeah. Like, what the fuck is this shit? I literally. Thought, okay, first of all, I'm just going to tell you what we're going to be doing in this video. Basically, because I've had a bit of a stress inducing week, like it's just definitely been a bit of a downward week. <clears throat> Needless to be said, I'm just going to have a nice shower. I know I did this last video, but dude, I don't even fucking care. Actually, no, it was a video before. I don't fucking care. I need to just have a shower, reset, make my bed, clean my room, I water my plants. I just need to have a zen day because. I just need to get my life together. I really just need to pull my shit together because this week was unhinged. I was unhinged. I reckon I did not I had the, my sleep schedule was fucked. I was staying up till 2 a.m. like on school nights trying to like edit a vlog for Thursday, but then I ended up hating the vlog and I had to leave school early to like film the vlog, but then I didn't end up even watching the vlog and it was just really bad. You know what? It really wasn't that bad, okay? It could have been much worse. So I don't want to come on here and be complaining and you're like, Emma, okay, someone could have died. You know what I mean? Like that kind of stuff happens. I fucking know, okay? I am fully aware of that. But that doesn't mean that I didn't have a really shit week, okay? A really stressful week. I handed in my English, which mind you, I know that I complain about school, but I normally get A's in English. Like I've been getting A's in English since like the dawn of time, which I'm like excited because I worked really fucking hard on it, okay? Like I actually tried really hard. I spent hours writing that shit. And my teacher said it was really good. So I'm like, okay, this is good. Um, then I get my plagiarism results back. Apparently it was 100% plagiarized. 100%. Is that even fucking physically possible? That would mean that every single word on my whole 1,500 word document was copied from someone else. Who? Who am I copied it from? I do not fucking know because guess what? I wrote it myself. Basically, what happened was I had written the whole thing by myself and instead of, because I was so short of time, instead of getting someone else to check my spelling for me because I'm a dyslexic piece of shit, instead of doing that, I was like, oh my god, I can just put it in like an AI, like spelling checker thing. So I put it in AI, like the I'm sure you guys know what that is. And I said, can you please fix the spelling on my essay? And like grammatical errors, thanks. Sent it back, it fixed all the spelling mistakes, all was good, I uploaded it. Apparently AI wrote my whole English when it fucking didn't. And even my teacher was like, Emma, I know that you wrote this, like your past exam results and everything, and even your notes in class, so show that you know what you're fucking talking about and show that you wrote it. So I think it's fine. I don't really know. I'm still kind of really stressed because I don't, ugh, I don't even know. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. So that was the first thing. My maths teacher told me that we had our external maths exam this week. This week, the one that we just had. Um, and apparently she lied to us. She was like, sorry, I just wanted to get, I just wanted you guys to study for your mock, like your practice exam. So I lied. This is just your practice exam. Who does that? Who, who does that? Who the fuck does that? Anyway, so I'm pretty sure my external exam is next week. I don't know. Cause guess what? Guess who has trust issues now? Me. Can't even trust my teachers. They're gonna tell me when the exam is because they're like trying to like prepare me. The audacity! I don't need you to trick me into into studying. Maybe I do, but I don't. I don't appreciate it. Sure as hell, I don't appreciate it. Guys, I'm sorry. I feel like I've really ruined the vibe of this bit by me just like getting all ang angry. I'm really sorry. For motivational content. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like speaking about like my emotions at all. Don't really like that. I prefer to avoid and run away from my problems, but whatever, I guess I can't really do that. So <clears throat> I don't really like talking about like, I don't know how I'm feeling. Kind of makes me feel a little bit ill, but whatever. Um, and I don't wanna talk to you guys about it because I feel like you guys, well, I feel like you guys think I have no problems going on in my life, which, you know what, I really don't. 
I'm not going to be super naive and act like I have this really hard life when I fucking don't. I've had everything hand given to me on a silver platter. Like, I'm so aware of that. Okay, and I don't want you guys to think I'm living in this nut little bubble. Um, but I think some of you might forget sometimes that I still struggle with some things. And I don't know, maybe you guys don't know everything about my life because obviously I try to come across as, um, what's it called? Genuine as possible on here. And I don't like keep secrets from you guys. But I think you also need to remember that you're only seeing what I want you to see. And maybe there are some things, like you don't know me, you don't actually know exactly what I'm going through. So I just wanted to, wow. Oh my God, I hated that. Oh my God. I can't do this. I can't talk. I can't have a serious conversation with you guys. I just want to like have fun, but I feel like you just need to know. Basically, I don't like talking about like anxiety or any of that because people are like, I mean, you have the least stressful life, like, ever. Like, what the fuck do you have to be stressed about? Literally, someone commented on one of my TikToks, and I, when I said I had a traumatic school week, and they were like, oh, did Starbucks run out of your favorite account? First of all, I hate Starbucks, so clearly I don't know me at all. And second of all, no, they didn't run out of my camel. I don't even know where I'm going with this. But I just wanted you guys to know that I've been, had, like, my anxiety has been through the roof this week. Like, through the roof. Like, I haven't slept very well at all i'm behind in all my assessments i haven't i didn't film a vlog on thursday i'm just like overall really stressed out and i wanted to come across as honest as possible so we're just gonna do a little i don't know just a relaxing vlog so i just need to pull my shit together because honestly i'm spiraling i'm gonna be for real i'm actually spiraling like 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 plummeting like downwards so me and you yeah we're gonna have a little like i don't know calming day are you guys okay with that well i'm already feeling way more fresh guys like don't i just seem had a shower, put some makeup on. These flowers are kind of old. I probably need to throw those out soon, but they look cute in this big. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, I've already in like my, a way more, be like a much better mood. So I'm sorry I had to put you guys through that. I was having a bit of a crisis. I'm, I'm being honest. Normally I don't yell that much, okay? I was getting a bit emotional. I was getting a bit angsty, okay? So sorry about that. Hopefully I didn't ruin your guys' mood too much. But yeah, look, look who, look who's back. Emma's back. I've, I don't know, pulled myself together. And we're back on task. Um, yeah, I kind of need to, I need to feed the horses. And then we can just like sit outside, relax. Oh, lots of you have been saying you wanted more horse riding videos. I reckon I'm going to film one for Thursday. So stay tuned for Thursday's video. I know I haven't been posting on Thursdays because I've been busy. But this Thursday, I want to go for a cute little horse ride after school. And it's going to be really fun. Okay, because I haven't gone on one in a while because I've been really busy. But I'm going to make time for it. You know what I mean? So. I am so comfy right now. I have no reason to get up. I have no reason. Okay, not really. No, I'm just gonna put this rug down. Wow, everything's so clean right now. I'm really loving how organized this is. I'm already feeling so much better. I feel like cleaning your room really just solves a lot. Like it just declutterizes. It's not a word, but you know what I mean? Now I can go sit outside and like, reconnect with nature after my like horrendous week okay so we're gonna go feed the horses bye bye oh yes they're already here thank god i didn't feel like gonna go trudging to go get them um i'm gonna go get the buckets it's not as, um, I don't think that I don't like about winter is it's not as green. Like, why is it kind of dead? Hi, Piper. Put your head over. Oh. Hi, Piper. Hi, Fergus. Okay. 
buckets acquired. Food is acquired. Calm down. Yes. 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 Oh, yum. Are you excited for your food? Munch, munch. This looks so, this, this looks so yummy. That looks really good. Yum. I'm salivating just looking at that. <laughs> looks really yummy. Lucky, lucky horse. Okay. How yummy does, is that, Piper? 10 out of 10, what do you rate it? We haven't been up here for a while. It's been a hot minute since we've gathered up here. This is so nice. Well, thanks so much for hanging out with me today, guys. I needed that. I needed that to have that like rant at the start and then we just did some relaxing stuff. So thanks so much for hanging out with me. Sorry if I put you guys in a bad mood and sorry that we didn't really do a whole lot, but I hope you guys still had fun hanging out with me. And I'll see you guys Thursday and I reckon we'll do a horse riding vlog. We can go for a horse ride and just do stuff around the house and have a nice afternoon.